Welcome to another Simple Dad Opera tutorial. In this video, I'll show you how to use ChatSonic AI in your Opera browser. If you're new on the channel and you want to find out more about your iPhone, your Android phone, or any other social media apps, then go ahead and hit that subscribe button to become a part of the Simple Dad community. Hit the like button if you find this video useful. So in the battle of AI powered browsers, Opera browsers have recently revealed their integration with ChatGPT and ChatSonic in its sidebar, as well as an AI feature called AI prompts in the address bar. For those who are unaware of ChatSonic, this is an alternative to ChatGPT. And in this video, I'll show you how to use it. So as of now, ChatSonic AI, it's only available on your desktop PC or Mac. Unfortunately, it is not available on your mobile device or your iPad. So let me show you how to get this for your Mac or your PC. So you wanna first go ahead and open up a web browser, navigate to opera.com. This will take you to this page here. Tap on downloads and then download the Mac version or your PC version. Once that's downloaded, go ahead and install the app. Now, once that's installed, it'll automatically open the app for you. Now to set up ChatSonic on your Opera browser, you wanna make sure your Opera browser is opened. Next, you wanna tap on the three lines here, the top right. Now you wanna scroll down until you see AI prompts and it is an early access. So you're seeing a preview of it. So as it reads, it enables AI prompt in the address bar and text highlight pop-up connected to the services such as ChatGPT and ChatSonic in Opera browser sidebar. So when I say sidebar, it's this bar here at the, at the left hand side. So go ahead and enable the services. Now, once you do that, go back to your Opera browser. Now on the left hand side, you'll see your ChatGPT. And then just below that, you'll see ChatSonic. So to use ChatSonic, you wanna go ahead and tap, click on it. You'll get this page here. You wanna tap on start chatting. Now here, this will ask you to log in so you can use your Google account or your Apple account. So I'll go ahead and use my Google account. And now once you've logged in, tap on ChatSonic again. And now once you're signed in, you'll see this here. This prompt will show you all the ChatSonic features. Have a read. And once you're happy, tap on let's go. And here you can customize your ChatSonic so you can integrate Google search. You can enable text-to-speech conversion. You can enable or disable follow-up memory. Search results, you can have concise or detailed. Location, you can change your location. And images, you can have a stable diffusion or dial E. So these are the image creation tools. Once you're happy, tap on save preferences. And now here you can use the AI powered chatbot to help you out create any content you want to create using ChatSonic. So I'll ask it to create me a YouTube script to disable extreme alerts on iPhone. And there you go, it has created me a YouTube script on how to disable extreme alerts on my iPhone. So there you go, that is how to use a ChatSonic AI in your Opera browser for free. If this video is helpful, then please subscribe to see more videos like this. If you have any other questions, then please do let me know in the comment section down below. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one.